Hey everybody, Pookie TV X, Common Sense. I'm gonna say some shit I haven't said ever. Ever. Subscribe, like, and comment, and share. I rebooted this channel to try and save the youth. It may be in a harsh way, but it's necessary. You can't put a kid in the corner no more. They'll turn around and blow your fucking head off with a Draco. You get what I'm saying? All that soft shit. Oh, okay, you don't gonna be on punishment. Punishment? This nigga just killed two people. You tell my goddamn punishment? He punishing you. And I do this for the situation that happened with my son to where he's doing 30 years in prison at the age of 16. No driver's license. No shot on his 21st birthday. Uh, no rental. He ain't rented nothing. He ain't nothing. So everything that we do and it's easy to us, his kids is never going to see that. All that nice shit is over. Support it. We got to save these kids, man. It don't matter if we only save one. At least we did something. We could go up there with our little one save, and guys are going to kick us right on through. And we're going to go hang out with everybody. Toast up and shit. It's not going to hurt. Let's get it going. Let's get it goddamn going. Every kid and youth deserves a shot at life. Thank y'all for y'all time. Hey everybody, Pooper TVX, Common Sense. YNW Melly, Mistrial. It's not over. I think that um, Portland I'm getting ready to throw you under the bus, man. And you gonna throw him under the bus. The way it's set up, the way that one witness y'all came with your best friend speaking on your goddamn behalf. One, one person, man one person so this could kind of be a tactic because now you both y'all the defense and the prosecutor know each other's playbook so this is a time to pay attention dig your heels in and uh, get some more goddamn witnesses man because that one nigga ain't gonna do it he ain't gonna goddamn do it you got lucky on this one. But you best believe, man. Portland ain't trying to go out like that. He ain't, man. He probably can see what's going on. You trying to shy yourself away from the whole situation. You trying to shy away from the whole situation. I had that one dude getting up there talking, oh yeah, man, he jumped out and ran and got in with us. He wasn't even with Portland. Damn. That's dry snitching right there, huh? Is that what they say? But that's what it's called. Straight dry snitching. Um, homeboy of mine. Him and his homeboy running from the police. They run from the police, they go to the house that they knew, and they run up inside the house, right? The homie, he hides in the, in the attic. The other dude hides inside of the big trash can, like the recycling bin. So, he get caught with ease. Open the lid, dumbass in there, right? 
And when he's getting caught, he yells, come on, man, come down, man, they got us. <laughs> come on, man, we, come on, man, they got us, man. Shit like that. One time, my homeboy got 99 years. And he said, man, I can't do no bad damn 99 years. The judge said, do what you can, and we'll do the rest. Lord, have mercy. Lord, if that ain't cold, I don't know what. So, Bortman, one of y'all about to go, period, period. And I think y'all both know that. It's kind of like a standoff. I think y'all both know that shit. Well, your one homie came in there and, 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 and lied. Lied, man. Straight up goddamn lied. Come on, man. That's crazy right there, man. This nigga straight up lied, man. It's gonna be going down, man. It's, it's gonna go down. It's not over. Them little wishes and blowout kisses, that shit ain't working still. How the defense had one witness and the prosecutor had all that fucking evidence and a mistrial. Something behind the scenes, man. Something going on, man. Something going on. So, Portland, you better have a standoff, nigga. With you, you and Mel. One of y'all gonna get that goddamn needle. Yeah. One of y'all get that goddamn needle on y'all shit. Well, I could be wrong. But time to tell. Kids, this what's happening. You think you got it home, boy. Yo, he'll die for you. No. Don't believe in that goddamn lie. That's a ball face lie. It's not like that. Common sense.